G'day, this is Alistair Christie from LearnDelphi.tv and in this video we're going to talk about colour, uh, in particular the colour used for syntax highlighting and background and all that kind of stuff within the code. Uh, to make adjustments, we right click and go down to properties, select colour and then Delphi. Here we have the default uh, theme colours for the syntax highlighting. They're, they're pretty good um, and there's nothing, nothing overly wrong with them. Uh, I like generally to customize them a little bit. For instance, we can now distinguish between sort of integers and floating point numbers a bit more readily. There are lots of different elements uh, you can customize. Um, I, I prefer a darker background, so if I just grab one, that one for instance, but you'll notice we need to change it for each uh, of the elements. Um, you can also select uh, a, a speed setting, so the classic, if you're familiar with Turbo Pascal, then uh, you might like that color scheme, uh, but I'm actually not overly keen on any of the um, available options. Uh, so let's cancel that. What I'd recommend you do is go and download a copy of Rodrigo Raz's IDE theme editor from this uh, URL on GitHub and scroll to the bottom you can download it and once you've done that um, install it and run it and uh, here we see we've got the default theme um, it might be in compact mode when you install it and then we can start adjusting colors similar to in Delphi but we've got uh, a whole bunch more tools to do it uh, there's also a large number of default uh, or customized themes. So you have the, the, the standard default one in Delphi. Um, and we can go through and pick one appropriate. Uh, but what I've got is my preferred color scheme. Something overly special about it, but uh, as I mentioned, I prefer sort of a darker background with less contrasting colors. It's sort of easier on the eyes, um, and uh, I found I was getting headaches, and this has somewhat helped with it. Although uh, that background, should be that color. Okay, and then we can. Uh, uh, Okay, it will help if we close Delphi first. And then I can stop running. Okay. Apply the change. And restart Delphi. Okay, and there we have um, the my customized color scheme. Uh, also, uh, actually, if we go properties, I was going to go tools, options, and it's a bit quicker. Uh, there's also the structural highlighting, so uh, little colored bars. You might need to customize those once you've um, changed your theme because they might not be contrasting enough, or they're, they're quite unusual colors if you've got those as a background. Uh, uh, good luck to you. Um, so that's kind of the, the two things I do is I usually install C and pack and change my uh, color scheme in the IDE uh, and I do that pretty much with every version of Delphi I work with. Um, so I'm Alistair Christie from LearnDelphi.tv. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this video useful.